Can you please introduce yourself? Yeah, my name is Samanway Chakraborty. I am originally from West Bengal, but I am staying in Guwahati for two years. I am studying in IIT Guwahati now. I am in the third year of the B Tech course. So the, today's episode is like, how much do you know about Northeast of India? The Northeast of India, actually, it is very much disconnected from the rest of the part of India, but it has a very good culture. The, the, I like the people there, their sense of fashion, their way of living. It's not that they are poor, but they have a very good sense of fashion. And the most problem with the North East is they are very much disconnected from India, only connected by a chicken neck kind of thing near the Assam. And what I like very much about North East is they have a very good craze about football. All the most of the players of the Indian football team or the various clubs are from the North East, from Guwahati, from Meghalaya and these things and I also like very, very much traditional activities of the North East just like I'm, I stay in Assam so I like the Bihu festival of the Assam very much the traditional dance and traditional music and all these things and moreover I, I like the food of the North East community especially the items that they make with pork and all these things and like any famous person you know from North East? any famous person yeah I know Mary Kong she is an international boxer from our country. Yeah. She's from Manipur only, I know. And I know one more guy, his name is JJ Alpek Kluwa. He's from, I think, Guwahati only. He, pl he played very well in the ISL and also he's in the Indian football team. So, there, there, there is one more girl I know. Her name is, I think, Pronita Sorgiadi. She won the DID competition last year. On Dance India Dance. You are into music or? Yeah, I am into music. I, yeah, I, I just forgot to tell that the North East have a very good culture about rock music, the Western kind of rock music. But it's not prevalent in the rest of India. Only it is mostly very much crazy there in the Northeastern part of India about the hard rock music. So there are many uprising bands coming from that region. Uh, so uh, what are the messages you can give to the viewers so that like there is no difference between Notice and the men then? Yeah, North East people are very good people, I guess. So, they, you should not discriminate between the people that are living in the North East and the other parts of India because I've seen many, many people in the other parts of India discriminate the North East. First of all, we should think that we are all Indian, so we should live together with peace and harmony. That's all I want to say. So, uh, I've heard like you stay in Assam only, Guwahati. Mm -hmm. So, uh, there you feel any racist thing or like. No, in Assam there is no racist thing, but some of. So, according to you, how can you bridge the gap between this, uh, this racist problem in India? Bridging, bridging the gap can be cannot be just done by just making people meet each other. They can be done by various type of activities such, 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 such as music activities or sports activities. These are the things that should frequently happen between different kinds of people. And the most important thing is that they should not have the government officials also. For, I'm, I'm telling for them only. They should not at least have some kind of racist type of feeling for the people of North East and the rest part of India. So yeah, that should be done first of all. Thank you for your precious time. Welcome. Yeah. Thank you. Like and subscribe any part.